Hey everybody, day seven update. Uh, I'm definitely having trouble today with the lisping. Kind of weird. And uh, the pain has made itself come back with a major vengeance. I did have to per dip into the Percocets three times yesterday. Uh, and Tylenol or Ibuprofen every two, three hours. I have the... Uh, the breakdown of the I know you can only take 4,000 milligrams of Tylenol in 24 hours and you can only take something like 2,600 of uh, Advil but you know what this morning was really bad and it's uh, I took some and about an hour later I felt better so pain wise it's just a process spoke with a friend of mine who has this and uh he or she, I won't say who, said that the first two weeks was about pain. And uh, about a month later, functionality. But we should be okay. So here we are, trying to recover. Uh, I haven't had the swelling with the dentures going back in my mouth in the morning. That's good, really good. Uh, here, what I've been eating, I've been eating rice, I, I ate some rice today, really mushy rice uh, with butter and salt. Uh, I don't miss food a lot because when you have all your gum sliced open and everything else, it's kind of, kind of hard to think about eating. But you know, uh, day seven, I wish I was at work. But I do talk for a living being a recruiter, so it's good that I'm able to give my gums and my lips a rest. Uh, I'm a musician as well. If you see on my channel, you'll see songs of my bands and stuff. Uh, I don't know when I'll sing again or even attempt it. But uh, the C-Bond is holding spectacularly. And I've only had one adjustment, and... Uh, like I said, the pain is, you know, it's about the same as yesterday. Maybe a little more intense because of the, uh, I'm eradicating the Percocet from my life. And, uh, thank God for Mom's little place in Merritt Island where it's 70 degrees and we're about four miles from Cape Canaveral here. Pretty, sir. Really pretty, uh, kind of mobile home vacation type park. Great neighbors. I moved them up from Carmel, or my sister did, and uh, the winters are just too severe. So they like the sunshine, and that's good. Uh, anyhow, I had to watch Beach Chicks' seven-day video today because of how bad I was feeling, and I just, I must have a low tolerance for pain because... Uh, this woman says she hasn't even taken ibuprofen or anything <laughs> on day seven. And I find that so crazy. It's like, are you kidding me? Uh, I just don't handle pain. When I feel pain, it's time to do something for the pain until it goes away. I just don't. I think men are cut out different from women. I really do believe women can handle a lot more pain than men. And uh, for various reasons childbirth being one of them I have to learn to deal with cramps and all that once a month from the age of like 12 or 13 us guys we don't know what that's like we're, we're soft but uh, anyway that's all I really have I know it's boring I, I wonder if these posts are even helping anyone other than myself there is progress uh, I really gave myself the liberty of taking 10 days off of work to just hang I have no desire to go anywhere, to see anything, to do stuff. I just want to recover so I can get back to work, you know? And I can tell you, though, it is pretty amazing to put a whole glass of ice-cold whatever in my mouth and not feel the excruciating pain I used to feel. So I do know that there's light at the end of the tunnel. And a friend of mine who commented on my site here also said that... Uh, he was in his 90th day, and he was already eating hard Belgian or German pretzels. 
which those are the hardest things on the planet. I mean, who knows? There may even be fireballs in my future. Maybe not, but probably not. But it's nice to know that this isn't uh, life ending. It's, it's life improving. And I think that if you've gotten to the point that you're even thinking about it, chances are you're a likely candidate because not everybody thinks about stuff like this. So, day seven. Tomorrow will be my one-week anniversary. And uh, honestly, it's been a lot more difficult than I thought it would be. I'm not going to lie. You know me and my pain scale. I thought it would be a difficulty of about a seven. And it has definitely been a nine, nine and a half, maybe a ten. I, I don't know what it's like having major surgery or things that are really excruciatingly painful. So me on my scale is pretty painful. But I do know that I'd rather have a week or two of pain, even a month, even six months, than have another 30 years of crappy teeth. That was not an option. So anyway, here's my puppies. There's Thule. And there's Pablo. Willie. Say hi, Willie. Willie. And there's Willie. So they've been taking care of me. They've been loving on me. And uh, we'll see you next time, okay? Have my seven-day report tomorrow.